It takes a genius audience to make a genius performance. Really All right, Charles Whitman, the famous Texas Tower murderer, really caught on with the imagination of the world. Do you have Eagle Scouts here, Boy Scouts? You don't have that. You do. Well, he was, you're all Boy Scouts, you're all Eagle Scouts? Well, Charles Whitman was an Eagle Scout. So was uh, Charles Manson. And so was Charles Manson's sidekick, Charlie Tex Watson. And they're all named Charles. Is anybody here named Charles? Any Eagle Scouts here? Sounds like I might have been. I'll tell you the guy, the name you need to really watch for, and that is Wayne. If you Google Wayne with mass murders, you will see that there's thousands of them. A guy's named Wayne, or their middle name is Wayne. And that's because their dad always loved John Wayne. Names a kid after John Wayne, and the kid, of course, can't come up to that. And one day he just loses it and kills a lot of people. And, and it's true, there's John and Wayne Gacy. Well, you don't know these people. Wayne Williams, the guy killing all the little children in Atlanta. Elmer Wayne Henley. And that's just three to start with. So I was in Houston last month giving them this story about Wayne and the murderers. And I said, is anybody here named Wayne? And there was about five guys there named Wayne. And uh, they said there would be more, but they're all at the rodeo. The rodeo was in Tennessee. So that's why. Should have ended on a pole vault. Right. Anyway, folks, as my spiritual advisor Billy Joe Shaver says, if you don't love Jesus, go to hell. Right. He was sitting up there for more than an hour, way up there on the Texas Tower, shooting from the 27th floor. Choke and slash or slit them. Not our Charles Joseph Whitman, he won't be an architect no more. Got up that morning, calm and cool, picked up his guns and walked to school. All the while he smiled so sweetly, and he blew their minds completely. They'd never seen an Eagle Scout so cruel. Won't you think of the shame and degradation? For the school's administration, he put on such a bold and grassy show. The chancellor cried, it's adolescent, and of course it's most unpleasant, but I gotta admit, twas a lovely way to go. There was a rumor about a tumor nestled at the base of his brain. He was sitting up there with his 36 magnum, laughing wildly as he backed up. Who are we to say the boy's insane? Now Charlie was awful disappointed, else he thought he was anointed to do a deed so low down and so mean. Students looked up from the classes, had to stop and scratch their asses. Who'd believe he'd once been a Marine? Now Charlie made the honor roll with ease. Most all of his grades was A's and B. A rear roof snort and trigger squeezer. Charlie proved a big crowd pleaser, though he had been known to make a couple C's. Some were dying, some were weeping, some were studying, some were sleeping, some were shouting, Texas number one. Some were running, some were falling, some were screaming, some were bawling, some thought the revolution had begun. The doctors tore his poor brain down, but not a stitch of illness could be found. 
Most folks couldn't figure just to why he did it. And the good would not admit it. There's still a lot of Eagle Scouts around. There was a rumor about a tumor nestled at the base of his brain. He was sitting out there with his 36 Magnum, laughing wildly as he begged him. Who are we to save the boys in? Who are we to save the boys in? Who are we to save the boys in the same? 